feel like you were struggling a little bit to find a rhythm out there at times? Yeah, I think uh, first three innings I was scattered. Um, couldn't get a rhythm down, like you said. I think I was working a little slow uh, to start the game. Uh, fourth, and fifth were, fourth and fifth inning were a lot better. When you say you were scattered, what does that mean to you and why were things just a, a tick off? I just think I wasn't uh, ahead of the count very often. I think uh, you know, I was either even or a little behind at times. Uh, they also put good swings on me, you know, got a couple hits to right field, and obviously with the Abreu homer. Where were you trying to go with that pitch to Abreu? Uh, it, it was, I think it was well executed. I think it was a little in off uh, where I was trying to go. Um, you know, having thrown two fastballs before that, uh, him fouling that off, I think it just sped up his bat, and, and, and he was able to get to it. Mr. what's Clay Holmes meant to this team this year? He's been incredible. Um, I still don't know how, how, how we got him, honestly. Um, you know, he's he's been an important piece since last year, and I think he's just going to keep on building off what he's doing. Aaron Boone said he has the best sinker in the world right now. How would you describe that that pitch and what you've seen from him throwing that pitch this year? Yeah, I was watching him uh, the, that last inning, and that uh, that fast fly through to Robert to strike him out was incredible. I mean, 98, bottom of the zone, moving so many uh horizontally big and it's it's incredible it's pretty special you said you were a little off was it everything or was it one particular pitch i think i think early on the the slider wasn't there um you know i was basically attacking with fastball cutters um and at times i felt like my heater and cutter were up in the zone i couldn't find that line that top of the, that top of the zone where where i can establish that pitch and and make them make them uh make them defensive there so you just talk about the feeling around the team. You're winning every type of game these days. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, we can beat you a lot of different ways. Uh, you know, at, at times, obviously, it's our big bats that, that come out and, and you know, put a, put a beating on. But at times, it's, it's the bottom of the lineup that, that just, just gets on and gives those guys opportunities to, 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 to knock them in. So, and our, our pitching has been great. Nestor, can you speak as to what's going on with you guys in the White Sox? There's been a couple of incidents now. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not too sure what happens. You know, uh, with the talks out there, obviously with with Donaldson and and and, uh, and Anderson out there, well, we're not there. But you know, we're, we're backing up JD out. You know, all the time. Uh, you know, as teammates, I think that's what we should do. And and honestly, I, I mean, I I can't tell you what's going on because I'm not there during the conversation.